Hi, this is Caroline from SoCanShe.com. I'm here to show you how I used Hatch Embroidery Digitizer to make this mandala pillow using the easy digitizing software and a coloring book design that I just took a picture of and uploaded the picture. So to do this, you'll open up the Hatch software and you'll click on New. So you'll start a new design. We'll do that right here. And then once the new design window opens up, we're going to import some artwork. And I have a really simple one right here that I'm going to use for this video. Then you'll click on um, to prepare the artwork for the embroidery. And I just changed it to two colors, so we have black and white. Then we'll go back to this screen, and I'm going to enlarge the embroideries or the coloring book design here so that it fits my hoop a little bit better. And then when that is just the way I like it, next we can use the auto digitize feature. I like the click to center line option here that lets me hover over the line and it will just click stitches right over the center of it. And then here I will change the color of these stitches to red like that. And then I'll go back and I'll use click to center line again and I'll do this bigger portion right here. And it all pops up as one stitching. So then I'll select it and I'll turn that red too. And I'll also make it a triple run which is thicker and kind of looks like hand stitching. Here I'll make this center one a triple run. And I'll go back to click to center line and I'll grab this last outer line here and I'll make that a triple run. So I've got this design all in outline stitching now in the triple run, which is great, but what if I wanna fill in some parts? So let's go here and use click to fill. And it will fill, the default is the tatami, or tatami, whatever you wanna call it, but I'm gonna click these little circles here and I'll fill these in with black fill. So here we go, it's kind of like coloring your coloring book image here, but we're using stitches. Maybe I want these portions filled in with black also. It's really easy to change the colors, uh, kind of like using paint program, but then you know later you can stitch it out. So I'll use click to fill now and red, and I'll fill in these portions with red and say I want this in red, and then I'll make this outer border. Now I could easily change those to satin stitching, um, but here I'm going to do, let's do more red. We'll do red here all the way around. See how totally easy this is. Um, so let's just keep going. Now let's change and see, uh, let's select something and change the fill. So I'll select this petal and just give it a motif. Now there's tons of different motifs. This is just one. I'm showing you what it looks like uh, just to give this a different look here. And then what if I want to try this ripple stitch here? So let's pick this and see how that fills in. That's interesting. I can hold down control and select all of these little petals here. And then I can apply it to all of them. Look at that. Now, if I don't really like that or I want to try something else, I can just try the different fills here that we've got as an option. There's the same one as before. Um, or we can try this cross stitch looking fill. So it's super easy and you can see here that um, the one that I used for my pillow, now this one, you know, five minutes, all done. Um, and we could stitch this out, but the one that I used, this one that I used for my pillow, I did it all in one color, and then I stitched it out using variegated thread, and you can see it's really detailed. It took me about an hour to painstakingly decide how I wanted that to look. Another thing you can do here before you stitch it out is delete your artwork, and you can also combine the colors so that you have just two stitchings, or you could make it all one color. Um, really easy, really fun. I hope you enjoy uh, using the Hatch Embroidery software and making your coloring book designs come to life. 
Visit the link below for more information about how I turned my embroidery design into this beautiful pillow. Thanks for watching.